What's up brothers and sisters, amazing and wonderful news coming from the kingdom of Wolof, yeah, Senegal. And why am I calling this wonderful? Because this is something that we've been expecting and wishing it could happen. Sonko will be visiting the AES and Kini, that is the Prime Minister of Senegal, Osman Sonko, will be visiting Guinea and the AES or Niger, Mali and Burkina Faso and Guinea. We've seen the president of Senegal, Jomai Fai, visiting Mauritania, visiting Gambia in the last few days. Uh, there was the Islamic cooperation and he was there. We've seen him visiting a lot of African countries. And this time he's sending his prime minister to the AES and Guinea. So this is what is happening. Prime Minister Osman Sonko of Senegal announces tour to the Alliance of Sahel States and Guinea. Osman Sonko, leader of the PASTEF party, recently announced a series of international trips aimed at strengthening political ties and promoting the Pan-Africanist and sovereignist ideals of his party. This tour, which will begin with visits to the Guinea, Mali, Niger and Burkina Faso, marks a strong commitment to regional and continental cooperation. The choice of these countries does not seem to be trivial. Indeed, Guinea, Mali, and Burkina Faso, and Niger are all key players in the West African political landscape. And their strategic importance in the region cannot be underestimated. By visiting these nations, Sonko seeks to establish strong political partnerships that could potentially influence regional and continental dynamics so i think this is good and there are two things one thing is the president said that he is going to convince AES to come back to Igos. that is one probably that's why he's going there another thing is probably they are interested in the AES. and the good thing about him going is we know that the AES is not coming back to Igos. what we know is this guy will be convinced by the fellow prime ministers for them to join the AES. If not, we are sure that AES will get a good deal of using the Senegal port in Dakar. So that is beautiful and uh, I'm happy for that. In addition, the president of Senegal, Jomai Fai, is expected in Abidjan, Cote d'Ivoire this Tuesday, that is today. People are disappointed because when we talk about Cote d'Ivoire, the president, we know, is number one supporter of France and it doesn't root well with the people. So people are very disappointed, even though the prime minister is going to the AES in Guinea, where people said we want to be independent and we want to give our all so that we can be independent politically and economically. Cote d'Ivoire is the opposite of it. And there are also reports that PASTEF, that is the party owned by Osman Sonko and Jumefai, will receive a delegation of French insumis in Dakar from May 14th to 18, 2024, made of elected officials and led, led in person by Jean-Luc Mélenchon. This initiative aims to strengthen the party's political partnerships. President Jumefai, after PASTEF victory, continues to display a pan-African and sovereign posture on essential issues such as international partnerships and currency i think he will not be compromised and i know you guys i know a lot of you are disappointed in one way or the other but let us give him time and another thing is as you can see the prime minister osman Sonko is going to the aes this guy you saw his video he was talking about rooting out french he was talking about how africa is mis misused by france and this time is going to the people who said no. So we have to wait for that. We have to wait and see what they will discuss. Sonko and Ibrahim Traore, Sonko and Katsimi Goita, Sonko and Abraham Antiani. Let us wait and see what will come out of this. And I'm hoping it will be positive, Pan-African and good for Africa and Africans.